updated. All right, hello everyone, Simon here. Welcome back to our playthrough of Quake 2. Uh, let's just get on with it. So the game, I mean, it's um, it's running and gunning, literally, and it's kind of fun, but the architecture is not that interesting, is it? Like, it's not terrible. It's uh, better than, for example, Fear. But it's also not... I mean, it's, it's mostly corridors and rooms, and it's... Uh, like, there's, there's vaguely... There's vaguely, like, uh, factory things and warehouse things. But it all looks very samey, you know? Everything looks, looks kind of the same. And it's all kind of grey and brown, <laughs> so it's... Uh, I mean, I feel like it could be more interesting. Let me just deal with these guys. What's he doing? Nothing. Alright. So, like, even everything's brown, right? Oh, crap. Everything. <laughs> And it's, uh, there's not that much variety going on. This kills you if you walk into it. I believe. Maybe it just hurts you. Can I get him to walk forward and die? Apparently no. Uh, okay, so he shoots me, but I don't shoot him. Maybe just shoot him in the legs until he dies. Alright, good. And what is what is going on here? Right, so there's like these blocky things and these kind of vaguely at least the textures line up. Look at that. Hey look, the textures line up. That's good. <laughs> I mean so there's like the attention to detail is okay. Just architecturally it's not all that well thought out in my opinion. Did somebody just walk into Oh he did. Haha, <laughs> get crushed. So, we don't want to get crushed. I don't know what's down there. I kind of want to find out. I don't know how I'm going to get back up though. Here we go. Alright, there's a secret area here. This lets us go back up. Let me just see what's down here though. There's a rebreather, which I'm assuming we're going to need if we want to go swimming through the tunnels. Also, I've been checking the videos as I record them, and they are much darker. The videos are much darker than... What is... oh... Crap. Than, uh, than, than the game. So, if you're, if you're watching the videos and you're wondering how I'm seeing the enemies in pitch black, well, it's because the, the game is actually not quite that dark. The videos are, are darker than... than what I'm seeing. Which, I don't know if that's good or bad. I think the game was designed to be dark, and if you, if any of you have tried to play Doom 3, Doom 3 is super dark. <laughs> like, unreasonably dark. I suppose it's meant to make it uh, a little more tense, if the game is darker. But um, not being able to see anything is not what I consider to be good game design. So we're not going to do that, we're going to uh, see things. Where's he going? Whoa! Why is that allowed? Why Why are they allowed to? Ow. Did he throw a grenade at me? Ow. Alright, let me just uh, come over here so I don't die. So that's not cool. That breaks the fan. I think breaking the van is useful. Uh, what now? Now I think we try and go through here now that the fan is broken. We can hop in. Turn off the alarm. Get another chain gun, even though we already have multiple chain guns. Where are we though? I have no idea where I am. So I don't know anything about this level. This is like a blind playthrough at the moment. Uh, barrels. We came in through a secret. 
Okay, now I don't really know where I am. Although we did pick up a lot of loot. Uh, Alright, that can be broken. Okay, there's a guy there. The ladder is glitchy. Wow, the ladder is seriously glitchy. I just want to kill him without... Before he wakes up, never mind. I'm, I was stuck on the ladder, by the way. Uh, okay, there's a courtyard there. I don't, I don't know where I am. That goes up, I think. Oh crap, there's a guy on the gun. They're looking at me. Alright, that's a, that's a rocket. Let's not do that anymore. Wow, almost died. So, what do we do about this guy? Oh, he turns the gun. Uh, this is not good. That didn't hit him, did it? That's not really doing anything, I don't think. He's still he's still alive. The grenade's not hitting him at all. So that's a problem. I'm kind of hitting him, not really. Alright, he's dead. So what is what is this? What is this? So there's a guy on a gun. Oh crap. Guarding this area. Can I use this? No, I don't think so. Ah, uh, this is bad news. Oh no, there's a there's a there's a guy with a rail gun on his arm. Is it a rail gun? And I'm almost dead too, right? That is a rail gun. I was railed by a gladiator, okay. Well, there we go. The game is not trivial. I'm not actually sure we want to go into that secret, to be honest. Like, we went in there and then we just got lost. So let's not go down into the secret. Let's just stay up here. Maybe I should have chain gunned him. Let's not eat the grenades. Right, alright, that, that's good. That's good, we're doing well. Holy crap, where's that? Where's that? Right here. So, railgun, we don't get one yet, but when we do, it's gonna do a lot of damage to whoever we use it against. Where is this guy? There he is. There's one more. Alright, there's a couple of dudes. What is that guy doing just standing there? Alright, he's dead. So, uh, yeah, things not going too well for us. Oh no. Alright, that's still fine. So we can always go back for that secret once we figure out what we're doing, right? Oh, more you guys. Okay, so the water is down there. Alright, so there's like two paths. There's the water path and there's the... 
round path. There's alarms. Uh, there's also, I, I just heard a guy, I just heard a not friendly guy. Holy crap, there's a lot of them. Can you fight each other? Oh good, good. Yeah, fight each other for a while. Let me just- oh no. Why did I- I did not mean to do that. Now, let me just go back up. I don't wanna- I don't wanna take the back way. Let me just go back up and go all the way back around. Where are we? Here? Also, what is this? That's not a thing. Okay. I did not mean to fall in the water. So this game, I mean, you don't die immediately if you get hit by a rocket, but you don't. You get two chances basically. If you get hit by a rocket and then get hit by a real gun, you are screwed. So like two grenades, two rockets, or two real gun shots, and you're dead. Let's let's avoid getting shot by real guns. What is this stuff? Computers. Well, actually, the architecture. It's a slightly more interesting now, this stuff. Like, you, know, you got arches and things. This is supposed to be a prison, although I don't really see. What's so prisony about it, right? We don't see any cells. It's mostly corridors and rooms. Alright, let's try to avoid... Let's not press the alarm, let's try to avoid getting shot. That... that is... that's a really tough barrel. Why is that barrel not... Really? The barrel doesn't explode? Why would that not explode? I don't know what this is. That's an alarm. Okay, I see. Yeah, but now what? Now what do you want me to do? You can push this. Was I supposed to push this? Yeah, but I don't know what the... Like... Is, why is that a problem? Does that hurt me, or...? Or I can turn that off. I mean, this is interesting, I just don't know why this is a, a problem. Holy crap. Okay, so... When... Deal with him, get the ammo back. So now we get to the place where the rocket guy is. But I'm not really sure what they want you to do here. Can you snipe him? Do you do you snipe him? Or do you like run in there and like fight, fight him? Do I kill him? Or I killed him, I think. Alright, so this still doesn't solve the problem of there being a boss here that appears. Let me just. Hold on. Let me save the game. What? Where did he Where did he actually come from? Oh, he came from back here. Okay, I see. Wow, I got back spawned by that douchebag. All right. So I mean, we're not dead. 
we got back spawned, but we're not dead. What should we do about that? Let me just grab some health. Come back here, grab some health. Alright, I feel a little bit better with more health. Uh, I guess we should keep going forward. And maybe we want to go back down into the water and grab that stuff as well, if that's loot. So the level is slightly more interesting, like there's two paths, right? I'm not sure how... What? I'm not sure what that is. And there should be a guy here. Alright, avoid the grenades. What is this, actually? What, is, what does that do? Okay, that's the door, I see. Maybe we should have came up here? Oh, uh, we should have came up here, shouldn't we? And then that will make fighting that guy easier. Okay, I get it. I get it now. How do I get back down again without killing myself? I suppose we have to jump down. Well, there's diagonal bits here. Nope, still got hurt. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? Alright, alright, so we, sh what we should have done is we should have come up here, gone up the, the elevator, and that would have made everything a lot easier for us. Ah, this is still fine. Let me just come back here, grab this loot. Okay, this is underneath the IC. Uh, no. Oh, there's still that guy. Let me... Take some hot shots out of him. What a... Loser, am I right? Stand there and get shot over and over again, am I right? Right, let's try not to get hit ourselves. And he's dead! Alright, all oh, this is good. I'm gonna break the fan. Get more ammo. Loot more stuff. Probably shouldn't spend this much time going backwards. <laughs> Because, you know, when we're going backwards, you're not going forward, am I right? Anyway, we're going backwards right now. And I guess I just grab all the uh, things. Okay, we've been here before. Alright, let's let's go forward now. Alright, I get it. I get it. So there was one ambush, which is uh, not that pleasant. But aside from that, everything else we managed okay. I mean, there's there's a right way and a wrong way to do this. You, 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 it feels like there's a right way and a wrong way. The right way is to come up here and go up there. But you don't really know that until you've tried it out. I guess that's like... Um, I, I don't know if I said this very much, but I don't agree with the... Okay, that was, uh, that was bad. I don't agree with the get killed several times to figure out the game sort of game design. Like some games... In order to figure out what you're doing, you have to die several times. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't know if that's like good game design. I don't think it is. Unless the, the deaths don't really have much penalty. I guess a game like uh, Braid, for example, like when you when you quote unquote die, you just rewind time and try again. So I guess if, if the deaths don't have much penalty, then it's kind of okay. Okay, that guy has a rocket launcher on his shoulder. And uh, we just spent a lot of 
bullets on him. Oh, this is good. This is um, this increases our ammo capacity. We definitely want to increase our ammo capacity. So now we can carry 250 bullets or more. Can we, can we carry more than that? We'll find out. Uh, I need to save the game again, just in case terrible things happen. We need the blue key. There is stuff down there, I just don't know how I get back up again if I go down there, right? So with this game, if you die, oh crap, you sound the alarm. Like if you die in this game, you have to go back to your previous save, which could be ages ago. It could be at the beginning of the level, and so then that is uh, that's a lot of penalty for dying. Can I turn this off? 